it works out too well. <laughs> so, yeah, my, my dad, uh, a lot of you know him as the Hall of Fame center for the San Antonio Spurs. Um, yeah, he's pretty good at basketball. <laughs> but <laughs> he's not that good at coaching yet. I'll tell you that firsthand. I'm not that good at basketball. I also hope he's playing basketball. Right? No, but he, he's a great guy. Um, one of the things that I respect most about my dad is the way he, he really carries himself and the role model that he's been to me and my brothers. Um, you know, everywhere that he goes, he always is very gracious towards people and he loves people. Yeah. And uh, when. Especially when we were growing up, when we had to go catch flights in the airport, or like we had, we wanted to go eat dinner. Like we could never do anything because, you know, my dad, especially in San Antonio, because my dad's so well known. So like, you wanted to go to like Disney World, for instance. I remember we used to do. My dad used to do these uh, like nativity scenes at Disney World, where they have like someone would be the speaker for like the like the big like Disney World nativity thing, and he would normally be the guy. But all day he would just sit in his room and like play video games and sleep. <laughs> And because he couldn't go walk around the, the park at day at daytime because we wouldn't go anywhere. Like we, we, it'd take two hours just to go from like one ride to the other. So we would always have to just say bye to my dad. And we'd just have to go around me and my brothers by ourselves. And we could never really share, like, we'd always have to share our dad with people. And that was tough growing up because you're like, I just want to spend time with your dad like in public. But you could never go out in public. So that was tough. But um, one day I just asked him, like, Dad, well, I mean, we have, a, we have a flight to catch. like. It leaves in like 20 minutes, like you can't be stopping and taking pictures with people, like we're going to miss our flight. And he's saying, like, Cora, the, um, it just, two minutes of my time means the world to a lot of people. You know, like, people always come up to him and say, like, do you remember 18 years ago in the airport when you, like, looked my way? <laughs> and we had eye contact for, uh, for about three seconds. Do you remember that? Because that's one of my favorite memories. <laughs> And, and he'll be like, and he'll say, uh, yes. <laughs> so, that's the kind of thing that I've learned from him. You know, just that's good. Be, be gracious <laughs> towards people. And, and just really loving on him. And uh, a lot of people don't know that side of my dad. But yeah, he's, he's, a, he's a great guy. He really cares about people. He loves the Lord. And, uh, you know, I wouldn't want any other person to do that. So, here you are, Dad. <laughs> I gotta say, that's the most in interesting introduction I've ever had. Um, this is really a privilege for me. 